Day two of Ohio's primary debates gives the spotlight to the two Democrats running for governor. Nan Whaley and John Cranley, both former mayors from Southwest Ohio, face off at 7 p.m. at Central State University in Wilberforce. Mark Namick is there with details on what we could hear tonight, plus updates on the latest news surrounding this year's busy primary. Hi there, Mark. Good afternoon, Isabel. More politics on the way. Dayton Mayor, former Dayton Mayor Nan Whaley, and former Mayor of Cincinnati John Cranley will face off tonight for the first time. They have been campaigning aggressively, but largely among Democratic circles. Tonight is a chance to introduce themselves to a larger audience, something they need to do, but also it is should be interesting because they have good backgrounds. Cranley is a graduate of Harvard Law and Divinity School. He was once featured on an MTV reality show and is co-founder of the Ohio Innocence Project, something he'll talk about tonight. Whaley graduated from nearby University of Dayton and was mayor of the city for eight years. She gained wide attention in 2019 for rallying her city after a gunman opened fire at a bar that killed nine. She'll likely blast Governor DeWine for his inaction on gun control. Both will talk about their respective cities and who's seen a stronger comeback. And we'll hear about the legalization of marijuana. Both support it, and Cranley pushes it as a way to pay for his plans. Of course, they'll likely attack Governor DeWine on a number of other issues, including his links to the first energy scandal and his management of the pandemic. DeWine and other Republican gubernatorial candidates were supposed to debate as well today, but after DeWine declined to participate, the event fell through. All right, Mark, we've talked a lot about the political fighting over the maps that define the legislative boundaries here. Any progress on that? Do we have a set of maps yet? Yeah, let's remind people that there are two sets in play here, one that defines those state uh, legislative boundaries and one that defines congressional boundaries. Right now, we seem to have a congressional map that was based on really inaction from the Ohio Supreme Court, so that's in play. But we don't have really a final hurdle cleared for the legislative maps. Uh, right now, the Republicans control the pop process, and they push through a map that still needs approval. So where does that leave us? It leaves us with a May 3rd primary that could be moved. But if there is one, it will likely not include those local races. So it will have things like statewide races, like the governor's race, which is why tonight's debate at 7 is important for everybody to tune in and have a choice to make. Isabel? I'm sure you'll be following that one closely for us here, Mark. Thank you.